But I've never been the type to fall in love. Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to another weekly vlog. It's currently about 8 o'clock on Wednesday. Oh, no. It's 9.41. I've been trying to do work on my computer and it just crashed because I have, uh, ever since I've only done two weekly vlogs now, it can't keep up. So I need to go this morning and buy a external hard drive because otherwise I'm not going to be able to do any work, let alone edit my videos. And I've got to do reports and everything today. So I have to go get that done and I want to get a tripod for my phone as well for the car. So I'm going to do that. But yes, I think this week's kind of going to be a little bit normal. We're not going anywhere. I hope you enjoyed last week's vlog. It was so much fun. Um, we had such a great time. And if you haven't checked that out yet, we actually went on a little long weekend holiday road trip. So go check that out if you haven't already. Um, but yeah, this weekend, this week and this weekend's just going to be probably, well, I... <laughs> probably going to be pretty normal um if you saw last week's vlog as well you saw that i kind of had a reaction to a facial just my skin is just very sensitive and it just started purging really bad but i'll show you i'll show you an update of it i just have some tinted spf moisturizer on at the moment and a little bit of concealer under my eyes but basically this is how it's looking it looks so much better than how it did if you saw it last week it was very red, very swollen. My neck was really bad. My neck's not too bad now. So I'll keep you updated on the pro progress of that. If you have similar skin to me, like it gets itchy if you use too much fragrance or it just seems to be sensitive, especially if your eyebrows wax and it's sensitive, then I probably wouldn't recommend facials that are too abrasive. Peanut. He's just got Declan's over it. Um, I probably wouldn't recommend facials that are too abrasive like the one I had. But anyway, it'll be gone in a few days and I'll keep you guys updated with the progress. But otherwise, I need to go to Officeworks now because I'm pretty sure that's the closest place I'm going to get a really good external hard drive. Come back and do my work. And, and I'm probably making toast now as well. Because I was so tired this morning. Um, we were up not too late last night, but... We're kind of just mucking around and just listening to music and stuff. So we probably should have gone to bed a little bit earlier than we did because we were very tired when we got home, which you probably would have seen. So I need to get that vlog edited and up, like uploading today. So it's uploaded tomorrow night for you guys. So I'll talk to you when I'm heading off to Office Works. But I've never been the type to fall in love. They knock down the old grocery store And more than now I don't feel right Oh my brother he is so sure But I'm lost without a clue and call it life Where do I So it's now 12 o'clock and I'm just popping out to get my hard drive. I think I'm going to go with, what's it called, like Lucy or it has the orange edges. That seems like what lots of YouTubers use and it works really well with Mac. When I got my last hard drive years ago, it wasn't even compatible with Mac. I was like a lot younger and I didn't even realize. So I was really, that's really frustrating. 
But anyway, I'm gonna go get that, grab some milk. Um, I'll show you guys what I grab at Office Works. I think I'm gonna get a little, yeah, a little tripod thing for my phone too on one of my vents so I can vlog while I'm driving as well because obviously I don't wanna touch my phone while I'm driving. Um, and yeah, we'll see what else I can do today. I've just left, left Peanut inside with a treat. So, yeah, see like, I really want to get a car mount for like up here um, or something, but a just a foam mount will do for now. I just do on um, one of my vents. I think that'll do. Um, but anyway, we'll go and we'll see what we can find. So I got my little mounting um, bracket for the air conditioner. So you, I'm currently filming on my phone now, which you can probably tell the difference. Um, but I got... This is the last one they had. I don't know why they seem to be out of stock of a lot of them, but anyway, I got the two terabyte, yeah, Lacey it is called. Um, so I'll uh, set that up when we get home. We can do that together. And then I also, I didn't really need this, but I got this really cute. It's literally just a notebook just for all my ideas and um, kind of like a little journal as well. So maybe like before bed or in the morning got that I thought it was super cute even though I didn't really need it and then I got this to on my desk so I wanted to get one of these for a while basically just flips over and then sits on your desk like cute and then I'll just map out my week I love stuff like this I think it is great and then I also got a um a mouse pad because I I need a new one, Declan stop mine. So thanks, Declan. And then this is the mounting thing that I got. I'll let you guys know if it's if it's any good. But anyway, I'm gonna head home now and set up my um this. Hello everyone, it's now 5.53 and I'm about to make some dinner. So I'm just gonna make these. I've, oh, I've never made these before. Declan saw them on an ad and wanted them, so I thought I'd get them and see how they go. And then I'm gonna make this with it as well. Which, again, never made it, so we'll see how we go. So I think there's like eight of these little pocket things in here. So I'll cook the meats first. And this is what the rice came in. But I don't think you actually have to cook it like normal rice. You just put it straight in the pan. And that just also came with sauce and spice mix. And then the pockets came with basically the same thing. So I'll get... So this is what I got to make it all with. Just some avocado, cheese, mince. The seasonings that came with it. Onion, the rice, tortillas. Um, two tomatoes, like a quarter of a salad onion, and little jam lettuces that I got today from Woolies, and that's peanuts food. I'm gonna make this now, and I'll show you guys what it looks like at the end. And I'm just gonna make some, make some. I'm just going to watch some YouTube while I make dinner. So I've just finished cooking dinner. Um, I've just got guacamole, lettuce, onion, tomatoes, salsa, mince, just some cheese, the Mexican rice, which I'm not exactly sure how I feel about yet, and the tortillas. So um, Declan's still doing a bit of study, but um, we'll probably just eat this and then watch Supernatural and head into bed. So I'll talk to you guys in the morning. Where do I go? Hey guys, so it's now 10 o'clock and I've got my computer set up here on my little tray. So this is, I think this is going to be my setup for today. When it's cold like this, I just don't really feel like going into my office because it, <laughs> look at Pina. It's just really, um, just really kind of wet, like it feels wet in there. Um, so.
So I decided just to set this up for now. Um, you can probably see on the screen I've got a Google Ad report. Oh, sorry, I'm about to do that. <laughs> really? Um, and then I'll write some analytic reports. And then I'll get cracking on last week's video. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Thanks. So I'll be here for the next few hours probably. Oh, oh my goodness. Alright, I'll talk to you guys a bit later. Hey guys, so it's now 12 o'clock and I'm about to make something for lunch. The rain seems as though it's died down a little bit, so that's good because it is freezing. Um, but I think I'm just going to make some like little lettuce cups out of the leftovers we had from last night because I have so much Mexican rice left over. It was alright, I don't know if it was the way I cooked it or something like that. I don't know. It's alright. Um, so I'm just gonna make that with mince, the rice, these little gems from Woolworths, some, a little bit of sour cream and cheese, and that'll be about it. So I'll get on to making those. I've just been writing those reports that I was talking about, and now I'm going to edit. Cool. Uh, edit last week's. Did you editing last week's vlog? <sighs> um, continue editing last week's vlog. Get that up tonight. And probably just chill out. And it's so cold. So you just feel like being a homebody, if you know what I mean. So, anyway. Yes, this is kind of what you probably saw in my last week's vlog. But my weeks are very much very much the same usually so i normally just get up have a coffee do some work have lunch do some more work and then Declan comes home so hopefully this is entertaining for you but anyway i'm gonna make this and i'll talk to you maybe when when i'm editing last week's vlog so i just made them they're just with lettuce cups sorry if you can hear the youtube in the background lettuce cups mince rice just a tiny bit of sour cream and cheese and that will be my lunch and I put a little um, little t-shirt on peanut because he was cold weren't you bunny but anyway yeah I'm gonna go eat this and enjoy it even though it's kind of more like a warm weather food but it's just what I felt like so Hey guys, happy happy Thursday. It feels like Wednesday because of our long weekend. Are you right? Peanut's just having a cough over there because he drinks water too fast. Um, it's almost 11 o'clock and I've just been doing washing. I did some work a bit earlier this morning. But I'm just going to make some toast now and then probably head on over into my office. Which, if you didn't know, is basically just the granny flat in our place is my office. Um, it just allows me to have a different area to work in that's not the house. Um, it's nice and sunny today. Yesterday it just rained and rained and rained until about, um, until about 2 or 3 o'clock and it just stopped and it came out sunny again, so... Anyway, um, yeah, I'm just going to get some work done. I have to go to Coles this afternoon, um, get some groceries, and I was going to also pop it over to Kmart and have a look at their rugs. It was freezing last night. It was just ridiculous. So we kind of get, need to get a rug for the lounge room because it does help keep the house a little bit cooler because we do live in an older-style Queenslander. Oh, my God, that's dry. Um, an old, older style Queenslander home, it gets like so cold because it all comes in through the windows, there's hardly no insulation, comes up through the floorboards. 
So yeah, I might go look at those as well. But anyway, I'll see what we get up to. I've also put some sheets on, um, some flannel -like sheets in the wash to give them a wash before I put them on the bed. And yeah, we'll see what else we get up to for the day. And then it's Friday tomorrow, and then it's the weekend, and then hopefully I have this vlog up on a Tuesday. So it's now, um, <coughs> excuse me, it's now 11.15. I've just come into my office to write my last um, monthly report for my last client. So I'm going to get that done and probably just create some content for my EI media page and um, start to edit this vlog so I can have it up on Tuesday night. If you didn't know, I work in um, digital marketing. So at the start of each month, I go back and I do a... Um, monthly report for the previous month so at the moment i'm writing up april reports so i'm going to do that edit this video get all that done um and then probably clean up the house a little bit more it just hasn't been totally clean since oh. yeah. that was just the florist because i ordered declan's mum from declan some flowers for mother's day because he just like works so much he would have just not been able to get it done. So I just did that. So anyway, I'm gonna go do this and then clean the house and then we'll see what else we get up to. Where do I go? How do I know? Hey guys, so it's now 7.30 and I was going to cook dinner, but then we had Declan's cousins come over and um, I didn't even end up going to Coles because I just talked to them all night. So we ended up just getting ingredients. I've never actually got stuff from this place before. But yeah, we just got Mazadorian dumplings, noodles and... Um, spring rolls. So we're just gonna have this now and then probably chill out and go to bed. So I'll talk to you guys in the morning. Good morning, everyone. How are we doing? Happy Friday. So um, it's nine o'clock now. I've just been up, had a coffee. Um, just done a few things around the house, watching YouTube videos, just had more of a slow Friday morning. And now I've just gotten dressed, so I thought I'd show you what I'm wearing. So I'm wearing these Stax bike shorts, um, Lorna Jane crop, Stax crop top, and then I'm just going to wear it with this bomber jacket from Luck in Trouble. I just think these pastel colours look so cute together, even though it's not very autumn-ish, it's more like spring spring vibes but anyway that's fine um so yeah peanut and i are gonna head down to the beach um after i get a few little work things done and then i'll give him a run and then um, we'll come back here um and i'm gonna head out to kmart because i need to grab a few things for the house i didn't end up going to Coles yesterday as you probably saw just because um Declan had some relatives come over so we just chatted to them and got over eat so i also need to go to Coles and get groceries Anyway, I'll chat to you when uh, we are going to the beach. So I'm just currently down at um, Scarborough Dog Beach and Peanut's just not giving me his stick. Ready? Baby? Ready? Go! It's just so nice down here. I'm um, sorry if the lighting's a little bit funny, but it's just so flat, like, I wish I brought my swimmers down now. Where's your stick? What happened to your stick? Where's your stick, buddy? <laughs> anyway, yeah, so we're just going to chill here for probably an hour and then head back home, so enjoy the little beach montage. Yeah, so you're not running around. Go, 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 go. They knocked down the old grocery store And more than no, I don't feel right Go! Oh my yeah. brother, he is so <laughs> sure But I'm lost at that Shops. 
there's slow people behind me. You know, I can see him in the, in the reservation camera. Oh my god, let me up. Yeah, so I'm just leaving the shopping center now. It's about 3.30. And of course I went and came out and bought all this unnecessary stuff that I don't even need. But I did get some cute clothes, so I wasn't really expecting that. I did have a look on the website before I went out. I was like, oh yeah, there are some cute stuff, but I wasn't expecting it to actually be cute. So, yes, I bought a few things in there. And I bought a, um, like a casserole dish that could also go in on the stove and on the, in the oven, which is what I, exactly what I've needed. So that's really great. But anyway, I'm going to go now and eat a cherry wrap that Mary got for Declan, but there's a whole packet of them, so you can still have some. Um, yeah, have a snack on this and then get home to Mr. Peanut and I'll talk to you guys and show you what I got when I get home. And I also got a wrap. Well, I've so. never uh, been the type to fall in love. They knocked down the old grocery store And more than no, I don't feel right Oh, my brother, he is so sure But I'm lost without a clue Hey guys, so I just got back from Kmart and Coles and Case of craft um, and this is the rug that I ended up buying it's just the medium size from Kmart in like the blue tint um, once upon a time I would have hated this pattern because in our old house when, the house I first grew up in um, the carpet was really similar to this and I remember I just hated it but it's like in trade now it's just so weird I think it's just come back around but anyway, I think it looks really good. It's a good size as well. I really want to get a smalling, smaller coffee table because this is our coffee table now. And it's just a bit big for the area. But anyway, I thought I would just sit down and show you guys what I got from Kmart. And I also have to put my groceries away as well. So I'll pop you guys down on the Ottoman. You've probably seen these. They're really popular now. These paint by numbers. And I got this one from Case of Craft. A little puppy and it comes with the brushes the paint and obviously the the canvas so i'll just open it up there we go that is the little print so it's just two little puppy dogs i thought it was so cute and we're just kind of having a chill weekend so i thought that was one of the things i could do this weekend peanut really the first thing i got <laughs> the first thing i got with this was this flannelette shirt so most of this stuff is just like comfy, casual stuff. So I thought it'd just be really cute to have it kind of unbuttoned halfway with um, just a pair of jeans. And then, or just with a singlet and undone all the way. Peanut! And then I also got this. These are actually really in right now. I was going to buy one from Dish for about $70. It was really similar to this. Can you stop? And it just looks like this. It's just a beige. Uh, it's just a beige knit. I'm not even sure what, what way it goes, but it was just really comfortable. I did try most of this stuff on. And then I got these jeans. Now I was really skeptical about trying Kmart jeans on and how they'd fit, but I got a 12, and they are so comfortable. I tried them on, and they just have cuff bottoms. And I bought this top to go under i don't, honestly don't know how it would look i'll put it on in the try on clip but it might look like crap i really don't know to put it under this so like this part's poking out i don't know we'll see how it goes and then i'm not gonna really be able to show you this because it's so long it's like a really long with a little turtleneck jumper dress and then I bought these pyjamas and I accidentally bought, look, that says size 12. So I was like, oh, usually I'm a size 10 in everything but jeans. I normally get a size 12 in those. But 
I accidentally bought a size 16. Lucky these are pajama pants. So hopefully they'll be nice and comfortable really because you always want your pajama pants to be comfortable. And then I just got a size 10 in the top. That's just so fuzzy. And then I got this bin for my office because I actually didn't have one yet. <laughs> want this one? Do you want this one? This one? Hello. I also got a bath mat for my other office. And then I like a salt. You know those salt lamps? It was a little... <laughs> it was in... The, the shape of like that Himalayan salt. Um, is that what it is? I'm not even sure. With a tea light in the middle. I got that. That was really cute. And then yeah, I got the the rug. So now I'm just gonna go unpack that stuff from Coles that I grabbed, and then probably get into some comfy clothes and chill out and wait for Declan to come home. He'll probably be home in about 10, 15. But I've never been the type to fall in line And knock down the old grocery store He just moved it! And more than now huh? I don't feel like Around my, my flame effect electric heater I'm so excited Oh my brother he is so sure Hey guys, happy Saturday. So you probably saw a few clips of what we got up to today. We just went to Bunnings, went to Fantastic Furniture. We're actually trying to look for a outdoor setting, which we found, which we would have seen putting us putting together and then us sitting on it and chilling out probably. Um, we then just, yeah, chilled out and then went to Coles and got a few things. And then we took Peanut on a walk and now I'm just about, now I'm just about to cook dinner. It's, it's almost 6.30 so I'm going to actually cook a pie for dinner, which I haven't done this before. So, well, I haven't done this recipe. I've cooked pies before, but I also bought a little fireplace. So insert a little photo of it here. I uh, just an electric, um, it's electric heater, but it looks like fire. It's so cute. I bought one of those from Bunnings as well today. Um, and then tomorrow is Mother's Day. Um, so we're just going to go down to the water and have like a brunch with Declan's mum. Um, and yeah, just chill out down there and take the dogs. But anyway, um, so yeah, sorry I didn't get a lot of footage today. We were literally just running around trying to find a outdoor setting. And we did find one at Bunnings and it was only, it was originally like $400 down to $300 down to $200. And we had a $100 gift card, so we used that. So that was only $50 each. And then my fireplace was like 100. I'm really tired, so I'm going to have a shower and hop into bed. So I'll talk to you guys sometime tomorrow. I'll just get like small clips when we're down at the water, probably just with my phone. And then I'll talk to you guys tomorrow afternoon, probably. But I've never been the type to fall in line. They knocked down the old grocery store.
So just to give some context here, we thought there was a mouse and I was freaking out. So that's what Dad, this is. Dad, under the fridge? Okay. No. Look under the fridge! <laughs> hey. hey. <laughs> this is going to go on funny home videos. How big was he? It's not that big. So it's a gecko. It's a gecko. <laughs> it's a gecko. It's alright, Pete. It's just a gecko.